What's going on, folks? TJ Larman, a.k.a. That Sports Gamer here. Not a full episode of Bullpen Banter. We're just going to call this a little mound visit. Uh, talk about some of the stuff that came out in the uh, GameStop Mondays video. Uh, talking about the batting stance creator and some of the little things in MLB The Show 18 this year. Uh, first thing, as I mentioned, batting stance creator is all new. You can be able to go in and uh, create your own batting stance for your Road to the Show player. And I assume you create a player. Uh, in Diamond Dynasty, assuming that is still a thing. Uh, and I guess you can do all the players in franchise. It's going to be a template-based thing based on all the batting senses that are already in the game. Uh, so you can make yourself pretty much from scratch using anybody's batting stance. Uh, but let's say you like Miguel Cabrera's batting stance, but he's got a little bit too much bat waggle. Uh, you can take that out. Uh, here's a couple screenshots of it. Looks like you're going to be able to move uh, each part of your body in the X, Y, and Z coordinates. Uh, and looks pretty cool from what they showed. Uh, the game stop, uh, no, the game spot video uh, had a pretty in-depth breakdown. Uh, they spent about six minutes uh, moving around stuff and just showing you how stuff works. Uh, and the system's supposed to be smart enough to not let you crash into each other. Like your bat waggle's not going to go through your shoulder, and you're not going to have your arms going between each other. Uh, things like that. Uh, you can see there's a bat waggle rotation, so how much it's going to move. Uh, how high up and down your elbows goes and your legs and your front foot and stuff like that. Uh, so if somebody like a lot of people were complaining about Aaron Judge's batting stance last year, uh, now you can just go in there and make any little tweaks that you want to make it look more realistic. I don't think this is going to work in Diamond Dynasty because uh, I assume it's all coming off the servers. So this stuff is only going to probably be used for uh, Road to the Show and franchise stuff. Uh, and I guess play now. I don't know if play now online, maybe. Maybe it'll be there. Uh, but we'll have to wait till the deep dive video to hopefully get some more information there. Uh, but yeah, so like if Aaron Judge's stance is a little bit wrong, uh, you can go in and tweak it yourself. Or you can wait for them to do an update and hopefully they will actually do it. Uh, but that's up to them if they're going to put in the work to fix those batting stances mid-season if somebody just makes a small little tweak. Uh, next up, uh, they have more uh, home run celebrations this year, uh, specifically more um, uh, like time-sensitive ones. Like, say you hit a big home run in uh, to tie up a game, your guy will go crazy. Uh, if you're up by a bunch, they probably won't go as crazy, and if you're down by a bunch, probably also won't go as crazy. Uh, guys dancing in the bullpen, that's going to be a thing. Look for that. We've got a couple of pictures of that. Uh, they're also going to have some team-specific celebrations for home runs. Uh, here's a Brewers guy dropping his elbow on the plate. Uh, and they're also going to have Aaron Judge's little home run bumpy thing. Uh, another thing they talked about was improved animations uh, to pitching to reflect a more natural throwing and fluid motion. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Uh, also, better arm slots and releases. Uh, sometimes I feel like the pitching is a little bit jerky, so I'm very excited to see this. Uh, as pitching in the game is kind of my favorite thing to do. Uh, so anything to make it look a little bit more realistic is pretty awesome. Uh, they've also updated the rain and the fog in the game, which is pretty cool. Uh, excited to play in some of those new uh, new atmospheric conditions. I do wonder, uh, they talked about some of the physics uh, of like air pressure and things uh, in the last video. I wonder if going into the rain and the fog is going to have some sort of effect on that. Uh, like if you're in the fog, will the ball not travel as much because the air is thicker? I don't know. Uh, would be kind of interesting. Hopefully we'll talk about that during the deep dive. Uh, they're also adding in rain delays right now. I think that's going to only be in franchise and probably road to the show. Uh, I wouldn't really expect it in on online games, but uh, you never know. It seems like the way it's going to work is you're going to get a menu like this, and it's going to tell you how long the rain delay is going to last. And I assume based on that, it's going to uh, reflect on your starter's stamina. Uh, so if it's a very long rain delay he probably won't be able to come back or if you if you do bring him back he won't have very much stamina at all so it'll be interesting to see how they break on that a little bit more uh also uh on the game spot video uh they did a quick thing looking at some of the creative player stuff i noticed they had some hairstyles based on actual players so this is the ender inciarte haircut uh we also have the christian yelich uh and the jose altuve and another thing they've added now for creative players and stuff uh is the addition of dreadlocks uh so that looks pretty cool uh and yeah 
that's uh, pretty much it for the MLB Monday stuff. Again, this Friday, uh, I believe the 15th, uh, no, this, uh, this Thursday, the 15th, uh, they will be doing their deep dive uh, into Batting Stance Creator and the little things. Uh, and then we'll be back on Friday uh, on twitch.tv slash thatsportsgamer uh, with an all-new bullpen banter. Uh, so make sure you check that out. We'll be archived on youtube.com slash thatsportsgamer uh, as well as in the podcast feed. Uh, so if you haven't subscribed to that, open your podcast app of choice, search for bullpen banter, hit that subscribe button. And uh, I hope you enjoy the shows, and we'll see you again in the next one. Take it easy, folks. <laughs>